Hey everybody, I wanted to give you a quick overview of the progress I've made on Henry's Day. Now, if you don't already know what Henry's Day is, it's an upcoming game available on Steam where you play as Henry who's stuck in the same day. Your goal is to figure out why every day is the same and in doing so, try to escape the recurring day. You'll want to explore your environment, talk to NPCs, gather items, and escape the day before it starts over. So with that being said, let's jump in. Henry's Day is set in Summer City, a seaside city known for its tall buildings, peaceful locals, and booming economy. The city is home to one of the most successful tech companies in the world, Zubel. From phones to watches to digital currency, Zubel offers the locals of Summer City everything they need through their products and services. The game begins the same every day, right outside of Henry's apartment. One of the first things you'll notice is that the game is an open world, meaning you're encouraged to explore your surroundings in order to advance through the story. The controls are standard to most PC games. WASD to move the character and the mouse to move the camera. You'll have the ability to sprint by holding shift while moving and the ability to jump by pressing spacebar. There will also be controller support for the character movement aspect of the game. The game can be experienced through third person or first person perspective. You can use the tab button on your keyboard to switch perspectives, so feel free to try out both while you play. There are many NPCs located throughout the city that you can talk to in order to learn more about your surroundings. One of the main features of the game is user-driven dialogue, so your conversations with certain NPCs can go down a variety of paths. Some NPCs will give you items if you choose the correct responses when talking to them. These items can be used to help you progress throughout the story, so choose your responses wisely. You'll notice a timer on your screen which represents the amount of time left until the day resets. There's also an in-game day and night cycle which will give you a good indication of when the day is about to start over. When the day restarts, you'll end up back in front of Henry's apartment and any items you've obtained from the previous day will be removed from your inventory. So to summarize, you'll need to talk to the appropriate NPCs, choose the right responses in order to obtain key items, and advance to the end of the story before time runs out. Sound easy enough? Okay, so let's talk about the progress of the development. The story is completed with about 95% of the dialogue already written. That music you've been listening to? It's the music that will be used in the game. The tracks are in the process of being composed and should be completed in the coming weeks. The game world is about 70% complete. I still need to develop one more key location and add more decorations, polish, and side NPCs to the environment. Some important things I have left to do are optimizing the game, adding audio dialogue and UI sound, animating NPCs during dialogue, and having others playtest the game all the way through. The optimization is going to be a challenge as the game world consists of many elements. I've tried to set up level streaming, but it's not smooth at all even after several attempts to tweak it. The audio dialogue could also pose an issue, mainly because of how much dialogue there is in the game and how expensive it could get to hire voice actors. I've been working on this game since February, and I'm looking forward to releasing the full game this fall. That may be pushed back depending on how quickly I can address the aforementioned challenges, but I'd like to stay committed to my initial release goal. Well hey, I hope you enjoyed this brief overview of Henry's Day. If you want to support my development on this game, you can wishlist the game on Steam right now. If you want to stay updated, you can follow me on Twitter and join my Discord. All of those links will be in the description. Thanks for watching this video. I hope I've sparked your interest in Henry's Day and I'll see you in the next update video.